That park, that park is so beautiful. Like, I, I'm blown away by how gorgeous that was. I wish that it was, like, easier to get to, but it's a very short loading screen, so... Mm. But it is definitely a gorgeous park. Alright, Tate, we've got to run inside and tell your sister your unbelievable story about the fish that you just caught. Where is she? Little girl, little girl. Oh, she's, she's viewing the striped heart frog. I think she likes the frog. She's in a good mood. She's happy. Because the frog is well decorated, she wants to tell a joke and get a promotion. So now's a good time. Tate, come on in. Come on in. Run up to your sister. No, no, no. Don't propose this crazy scheme. We need to figure out how do we tell uh, friendly more choices. Show off muscles. Tell unbelievable story. There we go. Go on. Tell her how you caught a unicorn koi or something ridiculous like that, but you're going to give it to her. She came out into the hallway, so you guys can chit-chat. He's like, you wouldn't believe it. What? I think she's dubious, Tate. Just a little dubious. I don't know if she's buying it. <laughs> he looked... And now she's... It looks like she's talking about her day. Oh, she's sharing ideas. Oh, Tate, your voice changed because he got he got uncomfortable. That's interesting. And she wants to get to know Tate from being near a friendly relationship. Oh, you want to get to know your brother? That's really wonderful. Okay, hang on, Tate. You've you've got to wait and let your sister get to know you a little bit. Uh, get to know. There we go. Girl, Pando. <laughs> She's got great oh motives, God. but he is pretty snoozy. Let's see, Lily's fine. You guys should know each other's skills. But I guess it always helps to get to know your sibling. And he's exhausted. Why don't we let him get some sleep, I think. But, let's first of all... Oh, and by the way, check it out! I've been working on the little uh, decorative collection area for Tate's things. We bought some shelves, which actually turned out to be pretty expensive. I was sort of shocked. And now we're kind of decorating the area over here. Uh, da -da -da -da. Come here. Nope. Stop that. Eh, there we go. With Oh, look at the little my sims just hanging out. Where should we put the my sims? I'm not really sure. <laughs> Can I put them under the desk? I'm not really like a super duper attached to them. We'll just put it down there for now. Um, there's the emotion potion. You know what? Let's give that to Lily. I want to see what happens if she drinks the emotion potion. Because right now, she's just feeling fine. She's not really feeling something one way or another. Wait, what, is, what does this do? The orange topaz has energizing decor 3. Interesting. Can I stick it up on the big shelf? I want to stick it up on the high shelf up here. Like with you guys up there. No? Okay. We'll put it up there instead. And then leaf frog, eggplant frog, eggplant whirl frog, super or surfer leaf frog. What do you look like, sir? Oh, look at him. He's really cool looking. Let's see if we breed. Uh, and then the striped leaf frog, the striped heart frog. Hmm, uncommon, common. Rare, eggplant whirl frog, huh? And it's rare. Ooh. But I think it's worth just as much. I think like all the frogs are worth the same amount of money. So, so far, so it doesn't matter who you breed it with. Breed frog with eggplant frog. We're going to do a little frog breeding. Breed the, oh, I guess you can only breed the frogs one at a time. Unless, yeah, you can only bring them, breed them one at a time. That's fine. And then let us get upstairs. There we go. And we'll move this little guy. Uh, enable emotional aura? What? What? Hang on now. Enable emotional aura. Enable... What? Ah! What's this? What's this? Okay, we're gonna pop this crystal back in. Energizing. So I guess that enables the energizing aura that the crystals give off. That's very interesting. What does she do? It just is playful. Oh, let's put her in. Let's put her in Tate's room then, because he's very playful. He even wants to get a toy. There we go. And we'll enable her emotional aura. What about this one? 
This is the raptor claw is just environment, but that's very interesting. Very, very interesting indeed. So what does the little scientist dude give? Just playful? Yeah, he gives playful too. That's kind of cute. All right, let's move him kind of over here for a minute. Dr. F. And then let's pull out the beautiful koi fish, which we're going to give to Lily. Uh, it should be in a tank. Please, please in tank. I don't want to just stick the poor fish in the ground. Um, let's see. M mount? I don't want to... Oh, I mounted it. No. I guess you can't have... Uh, We'll, we'll call the mounted koi fish unicorn after the tall tale that Tate told his sister when he came home. And I guess I guess we'll stick it mounted in her room. I'm sorry, koi fish. I, I didn't know it would end like that. I really didn't. But since Lily seemed to like uh, the frog... Let's see. Come here, you. Let's grab her a, a frog since we just got one. Striped leaf frog striped let's get over this striped leaf frog i think there we go there now lily has a frog too and will it take sleep we'll end their conversation oh look at it <gasps> look at the cutie patootie little striped leaf frog what you doing little striped leaf frog oh my gosh the camera can be so sensitive sometimes little leaf frog but yeah we'll investigate all the different types of leaf or leaf frogs <laughs> all the different types of frogs and that'll just kind of be Tate's spiel. But let's let Lily... Lily, let your brother sleep. Because he's really tired. And let's let her drink that emotion potion that Tate got out of the lake. Maybe it's like some sort of... Um, oh, Tate just became good friends with Lily. That's so sweet. Alright, Lily. What is this going to do to you, my dear? Makes you think about... Oh, she's happy! She's happy and... A little uncomfortable from the gross goop, but mostly happy. Tate, you can go to bed, you know. Let's see, meet someone new, get promotion, share ideas. So Lily is really eager. Here, go ahead, go ahead, come sleep. No, not on your sister's bed, in your bed, your bed. Oh, she's happy, but she definitely, and what's she going to do? Read gardening. Oh, she's going to learn a little bit of gardening. Maybe she's noticed her brother has taken such an interest in it. But Lily, darling, we need to get you working on your career. Because right now, you're not going anywhere with your job at all, uh, except a tiny, teensy, teensy bit of, um, mm, yeah, a little bit of career performance, but not much. Her daily task is to work out, which she hasn't started. So if we if we make her go jogging, would that work? But she wants to meet someone new. So you know what, Lily, it's your day to travel too. I'm gonna have you go travel. Uh, there we go, travel. I just want Lily though. Oh, I hope I yeah. Yeah, just Lily looks like. We're gonna go to the movers and shakers gym. No, it's just you this time, Lily girl. And we're gonna give Lily a night at the gym to work out a little bit because she is ambitious and she has to wake up early to go to work. So you know you wanna be fresh and ready to go from having a good night's sleep for work. Hmm. But yeah, she wants to be an astronaut. We're not getting anywhere just going into work every day. Fine. <clears throat> okay. Movers and shakers. There we go. So we are at the movers and shakers gym. Uh, which is... So it looks like you have to travel to... Wow! Okay, well, we've got a lot of people. <laughs> a lot of people working out on the ground here. She looks interesting. Let's, let's go... Let's go, uh friendly introduce ourselves to her. Is that Bella? That's Bella. Apparently we've got like a little competition going on here. She looks like somebody you could get along with. I don't think you should talk about cupcakes with like the fitness people, Lily. I don't think that's going to get you anywhere. <laughs> um, a heartfelt compliment because you're working out and Lily's here to do that. She's like, I'll take it. Sharky Gelna. She's energized and feeling good. Interesting. <laughs> Meanwhile, Lily wants to like share her ideas. Uh, oh, what else does she want to do? She's feeling energized from that little talk now too, and she wants to enthuse about her interest. Okay. You're very interesting, uh, Yaritza. 
I wonder if these are all randomly generated townies, because I love randomly generated townies. Lily, you're going to be picking up lots of useful fitness tips, I think. Yeah, they're sharing... Oh, wow! <laughs> they're sharing all sorts of advice, and now Lily is just going to get down and start doing sit-ups while they talk. That's fine, Lily. Clearly, this woman is a good influence for your fitness goals. Is this helping with our fitness goals? Are we working out? Daily task workout just started. Wow, who's that? Oh, she's so pretty. Alice. Oh, and that dress. And she has a really nice little tattoo. And she's pretty too. Look at her. That actually looks kind of a little bit like me. <laughs> Elizabeth Wordworth. Oh my gosh, there's so many cool sims out here. Acquired the fitness oh. skill. There you go. <laughs> Well, and she wants to enthuse about space with three sims in order to get to the next promotion level. Uh, Will you let us enthuse? Uh, yeah, yeah, space! Oh, what a good friend we found. Let's, let's get to know her a little better. Let's see, friendly, hip bump, ask about day, get to know a little bit. Let's find out more about this woman, because she seems pretty cool. Just nice and open, <laughs> letting Lily come up and chit chat. Oh, she loves the outdoors! That's so cool! You'd get along well with our brother then. <laughs> Lily, what are you doing? She's doing an impression on her own. I wonder what they're talking about. They seem to be getting along really well. Oh, who's that? I'll be back, Lily. Oh, she's cute! Zoe! She's got the little petite walk. There's that little play place for the kids again. <gasps> Is this another lake? No way! We can bring Tate here to fish while his sister works out. And he can just like chit chat with people. And I bet he can sneak in like planting random things in the corners while, while in, meanwhile inside the building. So you have to travel to each of the individual buildings. That's interesting. So you go to each individual lot, but you can still work with the outside. Oh yeah, there's tons of stuff for Tate to do over here. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Uh, hang on, Lily. <gasps> there's a lighthouse! There's a freaking lighthouse in the distance, you guys! <laughs> that is so exciting! This world... Oh, I didn't even turn around! Oh my gosh, and there's buildings over here. I have a feeling the world will get bigger and bigger and bigger, and I'm really looking forward to that, because it is beautiful. I really, I wasn't on one side or the other with this game when it came out because it's such a controversy in the Sims community, especially on the, the similar community. Oh, you're talking about cupcakes again. Lily, maybe that's why we keep a very well-rounded rump even though you are eager to work out all the time. Let's see. Good, so she's having a good time. Now she wants to go for a jog. Um, let's have her share her ideas. Well, that woman... Oh, that's not... That's not creepy at all. <laughs> that's fine. I feel like she just picked our pocket while she walked by. Who are you? Liberty Lee, if I find we're missing Simolonians after you leave, I know who to come for. I know who to find. But yeah, so that was really cool. Alright, we'll share her ideas. Reveal brilliant invention. Um, let's see. Enthuse about space. Hip bump. Share brilliant ideas, because you really want to, Lily. Because she's a genius. I like her. This is, this, Yara here, that's going to be your, your nickname, is Yara. You're, you're Lily's, like, new best friend, if you ask me. She seems super duper friendly. But since you're both energized, now would probably be a good time to, to work out. Alright, can you go ahead and energize Jog, because you want to? Lily, your energy. Oh, there you go. Look at her go. Do 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 do. She's like, all right, thank you so much, Yara. Got me, got me moving, got me grooving. Oh, is that Cassandra? That sure is Cassandra. She's texting someone. That's cool. I wonder where we're jogging to. Are we just like gonna go around in a circle? Are we getting workout points? Look at that! So our daily task is 25% done for our workout. And this is so cool. So she doesn't just disappear. She stays here and she just kind of goes backwards and forwards. When we get back to the gym after this little warm-up jog, we'll have her go inside and use the restroom. Alright. 
that's enough of the jogging, because now she wants to do some push-ups, which she can actually do by selecting the ground. Ooh, and she wants to get to know, I wonder if we have a sim in the area. Oh, you can send text. So she's active and loves the outdoors. Um, but I think she might have left. Because, oh wait, no wait, hang on. Look, it highlights her! That's what I was hoping for. So if you are looking for a sim on a lot, and you click on it, then you can find that sim because it will highlight them. So that is very useful. Alright, let's send Lily inside to use the restroom for a second. And then we'll put her on the treadmill so she can run next to Yara. That might be very, very fun. Oh hey, there's Bella. Hello Bella, how are you doing? Let's use the not so dirty bathroom. Because someone Bella, you broke the shower. Bella, oh, Bella, you don't look so good, darling. A little bit green, and everyone's commenting on it. But dang, this must be like a health fitness community because everyone is coming out in droves. Oh, who are you? Are you sad? It sounds like there's sad music playing. Who are you? Why are you so sad? Victoria, you're so sad. Well, that won't do. Lily, come on. Let's let's come out here. I can't I can't just ignore someone who looks so depressed. You know what I mean? Oh, and she seems so sad. She's thinking about a fight. Nope, I guess she's just not doing it. She's she's walking off. All right, never mind. I I worry about you, but never mind. All right. Lily's washing her hands, and then she needs to come and do an energized workout. Come on down. You're getting kind of snoozy, but let's see. Come on, Lily girl. There you are. Let's see if she can talk with her her friend Yara while she works out. Let's see. She's running the treadmill. Um, enthused about interest. She wants to learn more about Yara. I think that was... Oh, careful there, Lily girl! Hmm... What was it that she wanted to do? Get to know Yara. Select get to know from the friendly category. Let's see, don't insult her, that's so rude. Let's see, give pep talk, interest... She's chit-chatting, share brilliant ideas. Oh, I guess get to know isn't there. Discuss interest. Uh, ask about day, I guess. That might work. Unless Yara's headed out now. There we go. So now Yara and Lily are talking. No, Yara is getting chatting with Jeffrey and Kinley, and or um, Lily is, and Yara is headed out. It looks like. Okay, there you go, Lily. So this is how the working out goes. She seems happy. She had a good workout, so she's happy. She's got a couple books to read. She met a new friend named Yara, which is really cool. Can we text her? Like, send text? Does that, like, give a little emotion or, like, a little relationship boost? Boost? And can we text? send text your brother? Be like, Tate, I'm at the gym. Don't worry about me. There you go, Lily girl. See, you'll get there. She wants to become an astronaut after all. So that does require a lot of physical fitness. You really cannot lay off with the working out when you need to be an astronaut. All right, so did that help with our job? It says the daily task to work out is 75% done. Wow, she must have to work out a lot in order for it to count. But now I know we can send her jogging and she'll just stay in the neighborhood.